Alright. It's a good thing I saved. I'd be really pissed off. I'd be pretty annoyed if uh, I didn't save here. Alright, so I'm definitely not gonna like click on that again. Nope, not that one. I know you can keep going up, don't play with me. What are you doing? This is dangerous. Oh, I broke the game. Okay, at least now I'm back in the bounds. Oh my goodness, game! Can't you just give me a hint? Just give me some kind of side! Is it in the notes, maybe? No, 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 do not exit the game. Seriously, what? Oh, it's the backpack. The backpack that I friggin' mentioned before. I pointed out the backpack earlier and I totally forgot it was there. This one wasn't bad at all. It like blends right in too. Oh, where are we? We're still... We're still on him though, huh? Everyone with it is different, John. Just because she and I share the syndrome doesn't mean we share the same head. But you must be able to help somehow. Everything was okay at first, but now she's even more aloof than before. Even when we're in the same room, she's never really... there. It's starting to take a toll on me. I just don't know how to take it anymore. Well, I can't speak for her, but many of us do long for connections. Though, being able to articulate it is a different story. Just because she struggles to express it, it doesn't mean she doesn't feel anything. She's still there, right? Sometimes you just have to have faith that she cares. That's pretty difficult to do, day in and day out. I know. Wait, but why do you seem so normal, Izzy? I mean, don't you have the same condition? For one, I was diagnosed when I was still young. 
With effort, it's not impossible to acquire a guise of social norms systematically. But you know what? I both envy and pity River. I would love to know what she has. <laughs> Me. I'm an actress. Because I've been doing it all my life. Not only on stage, but off stage. And at practically every moment. I've gotten good at it because acting is the only option I have. It's the only way for me to be normal. But River, she never did that. She remained an outcast and refused to learn to step against it. I don't know if she was by choice or by limit, whether bravery or cowardice. There are days when I just can't stand faking it anymore. And then I realize that it's too late. The Isabel that people know of is all an act, and the real me has long become a stranger. I think in the end, I just envy her. Ugh. Hmm. I've never met a woman with it before. Then technically you still haven't met one. <laughs> This isn't part of our business, let's move on. Ugh. Yes, let's move. The world would be a lot more beautiful if people just remembered faces more. Anything new today? No. Hey, Meowza! What are you rereading there? The Emperor's New Clothes. I loved this when I was young. Still do, huh? Of course. Just for different reasons. When I was a kid, I loved the Animorph series. I used to watch that show all the time. I know, your mother gave you a book from it as a wedding present. <laughs> yeah, that was one odd wedding present. I guess I was pretty obsessed with it when I was a kid. Why haven't you read them since? Hmm? I saw them. They're collecting dust in the garage. Well, I just grew out of them, I guess. I mean, they're children's books. What's wrong with reading children's books? They're comforting. I suppose so. I think I'm going to get this one. I just thought, what can I grab? I can grab him. I'm not yours, you're not mine. Be my Auntie Valentine. <laughs> hey, River, this one's not that corny. River? Oh, we just need one more. But what about David? He's my favorite character. Uh, I don't know. What are you talking about? Animorphs, have you read it? No. Yes. Really? Sort of. Oh, oh. Do you know what animal is David's made morph? Um. What? I don't wanna. I don't know. I don't know. Is it like a tiger? That doesn't sound right. Don't worry, I'll find it out for you. Tobias, Hawk, Rachel, Grizzly, Jake, Tiger, Marco, Gorilla, David, Cobra, Cassie, Wolf. 
why. Damn, I knew somebody was a tiger. Oh, uh, just wondering. You could have just Googled it. Yeah, I guess I could have. <laughs> Alright, so then I should go back here and answer it. It's Cobra. Oh yeah, a Cobra. I really wish they kept the old covers instead of these plain sheets. Those were cool. Alright, so what? I guess that would be the memento? Yep. Yeah, so far it's a pretty good game. I like the story. I like these little puzzles. Uh, I don't know how to do it though. Oh. Oh, we're at a barbecue? Oh, uh, everyone's leaving already, but I just got here. Seems to happen to a lot at parties. Oh, go save your childish jabs for the insecure. An aged Animorphs book. Yes, it's pickled olives. I see le formage, but where's the mouse? That's the corniest remark you've made all night. Don't you mean cheesiest remark? Wow. I guess there's nothing over here. Yeah, where are we? Where are we in this? Oh, so now he's even younger. What's going on here, guys? John, do you feel any different? Now that we got the rings on, I mean. Oh, it's their wedding! No. Why, do you? Actually, yeah, I think so. What is it like? It's just different. Just the responsibilities, I suppose. Responsibilities? Do you like the name Anya? Would you like to name her Anya? I understand. Yeah, Anya is a good name for her. Hey, come with me. be a good idea. I'll probably trip and fall. Don't worry, just follow my steps. Ow. 
Ow, my ass. Uh-oh. I think you stepped on my toes. Sorry. <laughs> We're sorry. Come on, let's try again. Are they dancing or making out? Comfort, to honor and to keep in sickness and in health for as long as you shall live. I do. And do you take this man standing before you to be your lawfully wedded husband? To promise to love and comfort, to honor and to keep in sickness and in health for as long as you shall live. Yes. By the power invested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Ladies and gentlemen, I present you Mr. and Mrs. Wiles. Ah, the wedding. Oh uh, yeah, what did you think it was? I'm just bad at weddings, that's all. Fluids tend to escape from my eyes. I didn't know you were that sentimental. Oh, did I say my eyes? I meant my mouth. And by fluids, I meant both fluids and solids. Okay. That's a lovely image. Thanks, Neil. Yeah, seriously. Come, let's find a way to get out of here. All this happiness and joy is really putting you off too, huh? No. I just don't like watching people make mistakes. Sheesh, whatever happened to just take it moment by moment? <laughs> Alright, so I guess we've done all we could do right over here. Oh, I better go see how your aunt is doing. All right, Ma. Tell her thanks for coming. I will. I'm so proud of you, Joey. Joey? Oh, that's my grandpa's name. He passed away before I was born. Ma calls me by it as my nickname. How come you never told me about it? Because I'd rather you call me John. <laughs> uh. Not another sentimental grandparent childhood. What do you have against those anyway? I mean, you sure talk about your grandfather a lot. What? No, I don't. Whatever you say. Yeah, I know. I couldn't get the resolution to, uh... I couldn't get it full screen. Hold on. Let me see if I could actually... Oh, I see what happened. There we go. Oh, let me save, too. Yeah, thanks for telling me. I, I wouldn't have even noticed. I didn't realize uh, earlier when the game uh, froze on me, it looks like XSplit reset the resolution down. It can't be helped, River. I'm sure they didn't mean to. Come on, we're late. Wait, is that a rabbit? I think this is the source of all those folded paper ones. 
why would she obsess over some roadkill? Not to mention so many years later. Don't ask me, you're the woman here. I'll be convinced that I'm that I'm the only one when you do a cordless bungee jump. This must have started her obsession. Poor bunny. You know it's a fantastic wedding when the mementos roadkill. Wow. Hey. Maybe she saw it as a metaphor for the terrible marriage. So years later she began folding the rabbits because she was reminded of how rotten it was. Or, you know, something equally pretentious. Cool story, Neil. Don't keep running it over! Poor thing. What's with all the road kills today? Don't you look at me like that. It smells like a farm. And roadkill. Deactivate the scent simulator and get away from here already. What is going on over here? Oddball horse. Whoa. Don't do it. Don't do what? You know what. Don't not ride this horse? What are you, five years old? Okay, I won't not ride it. Yeah. Quit wasting time, Neil. Oh crap. That can't be good. <laughs> Don't just stand there, help me. Damn it, this was not in the job description. Is that really a good idea? She should be okay. She's not new to this anymore. But she has never done it by herself before. It'll be fine. I'm not a child. Ah! Ugh! River! River, come back! What's the matter? Let's go. Oh, look at her, she's a natural. Hey, wait up! Ugh, I wonder if Neo got off that horse yet. <laughs> Eva! This is about 19% more than I can handle. What a moron. Uh, what the cord cop. This chick, the way she talks is like ridiculous. have to like chill around them for a little bit.
I don't know where the memento would be. Idiot partner. Ah, come on. Hey, right, come on, get out of the way. Horse, horse, stop it. What do I have to do? I hate this memory. Diagnosis certain? Yes, it reaches a consensus on the results. I guess this is when they first get the news. Unfortunately, like many cases of perverse developmental disorders, this is a rather late day diagnosis. Had you known when you were a child, miss, it could have saved you a lot of trouble. Do you have any books on it? This one is by Tony Atwood. He's one of the specialists on the subject. You can borrow it free of charge for now, just don't elope with it. Thanks, Doc. Now, are you two a couple? Unmarried and without any other leg uh, without any other current legal affiliation. Yes, I see. Well, I could give you a referral to a specialized counselor if you wish. Is there anything unsettling in the relationship? No. And you, sir? No, it's fine. Nonetheless, sir, you should also give the book a read. He didn't sound too confident there. It'd help you understand her condition. I'd rather not. Why is that? Well, it's your call. In the meantime, there is one thing... There is a thing called... Equian therapy that might help her. A ranch just north of here offers it. I can contact them for you. Told you so. Excuse me, could you please silence the clock? The ticking really bothers her. It's not that severe. It'll be okay. I'll be okay. No problem. It's standard policy. If there's anything at all that makes you uncomfortable, just let me know. Thank you. Huh. I guess that explains the ones in the house. Uh, 
Ah, that's the memento. Okay. Just a bit longer. They'll be calling for you soon. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Plain handbag. All right, what are we missing? Her platypus. I can't believe this piece of atrocity is dated all the way back here. Looks like someone took good care of it. She's still got pretty bad taste in animals, though. Get up on there. Ugh, four moves, huh? I don't know if I could do it in four. I guess I could. <laughs> now where are we? Oh, now he's like a kid. That was a that was a pretty good jump, I guess. Psst, look. I know. I can't believe he once paid to see this crap in theater. No, you idiot. Look, we leaped. Holy overcooked macaroni. The kid's in the theater all by himself. What a loser. You go to the theater by yourself all the time. That's different. No one's confident enough to match my taste. But that aside, how could anyone last do this rubbish? Hater. Oh, what's wrong with the music? And thus, this movie sucks on both physical and metaphysical levels. EQ... Wait, Q-E-D. Wow, dyslexic. Come on, let's go. What? Oh, right. Was well, he gonna say something? Whoa, wait. I ain't talking to no emo teenager. Grammar, my dear Watson. Shut up. That's not even a full sentence. Let's just go look for mementos. <laughs> that was weird. What are you doing? That's the third person you've removed here. Eh, not like it's permanent. You're elusive because you're not. You know that poking them out of the way like that does nothing, right? Then why complain? What is that? There has to be a reason for me to do this. Oh look, this place is all empty and creepy now. I hope you're happy. I'm incredibly happy, actually. Getting stood up. Now that's a Kodak moment. You relate well with your kin, I see.
Well, there's nothing here. Hate to say it, but I guess I have to nag something out of him again. All yours. Ugh, at least there's no olives this time. Alright, so go talk to the poor kid. Can we can we do something? I mean, what's going on here? River? You were in there this whole time? I waited for you at the lobby. I thought you didn't come. Why did you leave? I thought we were watching the movie together. Huh? I'm the one who should ask that. What do you mean? We were watching the, the movie together and then you left. We weren't watching it together. I didn't even know you were where you were. If you saw me in there, why didn't you come and find me? What difference does it make? We were watching the same movie in the same room. Okay, so she's been odd since she was a kid. Ha ha ha! What's wrong? You're so weird. Do you not want to watch the movie together anymore? Of course I do. Come, let's head back in before it ends. I feel like I should make a clever remark. You feel wrong. Well, the tow bar ride's waiting for us in there. Well, actually, should we go in this one? No, we can't. <laughs> and there goes that platypus again. What are you doing? You know, I think this platypus is growing on me. Mostly just for convenience, but hey. going on now? Come on, dude. Grow some balls. Uh... It's not that. Look, maybe this wasn't such a good idea. Oh, sheesh. What could possibly happen? Just think about it. Worst case scenario, she says no. You strut on like nothing happened. No one... No one will know and everyone will still think you're cool. But what if she tells someone? Or yells at me. Don't be a little wuss. Or, or says yes but really means no. <laughs> Quit worrying. Who would do that? And what if she throws an encyclopedia in my face? I don't even have a helmet. Dear lord, I'm so not prepared for this. Dude, don't panic. Just straighten your spine and quit being a little wuss. Yeah, you tell him. Everything will be alright, just turn around. Okay, okay. H hey, what are you... Shh. Um... Hello. Uh, hello? Can you hear me? Yes? Then why didn't you... <sighs> Never mind. Um, that's a cool platypus you got there. What are you reading? A book? About platypus? No. Oh, I, uh, I think that's great. 
Hey, you wanna... Lighthouses? Huh? They're exactly 16 second order Frenzel Lens lighthouses in the country left. Nine of them are coastal and one of them was modified from a historic kerosene lamp lighthouse. Oh, what is that you're reading about? Uh, say, you wanna go catch a movie together sometime? I don't know. That's okay, I'll give you time to consider it. I can't. Why? There's no date or time. Oh, um, how about this Saturday at 8? Well? Eva, I think the system froze. Yes. Oh, great. Never mind. I guess we'll work out the details later. What a weird girl. Uh, I'll just... What? What are you looking at me for? You think I'm going to call out how utterly awkward that was? Well, just forget it. I'm not giving in to your expectations. Give him a break. He was still just a kid. You of all people should relate. What's that supposed to mean? Shut up and go. Shut up isn't my name, you know. Well, I suppose if you look at it from the right angle. No, not really. Never mind. Oh, I thought she was gonna do something. What the heck were you doing in there, dude? What? I asked her out. No, that was pathetic. If I were you, I would have just barged in there and be all like, Hey, you! Go out! Me! You now! That's just terrible. I know, and it would have still been better than what you just did. You're not a Da Vinci trained by drawing eggs. Barrels are like very big eggs. Therefore, you will all be very big Da Vinci's. Whatever. Dear Lord, I can't believe you got me to take this stupid class. Oh, come on, it's fun. Okay, o only if you can paint. You'll get good if you practice, you know. Yeah, right. After this class, I'm never picking up a brush again. Is he gonna say something? Quit complaining. Whew, excuse me. I'm sure you'll learn to enjoy it someday. Why do we have to draw suit with barrels anyway? Anyone? Anyone at all? Alright then. River, why don't you answer it? Oh, this has to be good. I know you know the answer. We're waiting, River. Fine, I guess we'll have to. He made a sail... Wait, he made sail on August 3rd of 1492 from the Spanish city of Palos de la Frontera, which was founded in 1322 and granted to Alvar Perez de Guzman was at the mere age of 14 by the... Okay, okay, I only asked for the date. But see, was that so hard? It's, I don't know, it could have been. Good lord, does everyone with her condition have near photographic memory? Not really, though I think their rote memory is often fairly strong. coming this way. Alt tab, alt tab. <laughs> alt F4. Wait, what's here? Oh. 
that's a wrap. Beam Trumps better be uh, better next time. Eh, a trium. We could, we could use this place later. I just can't believe that these court lines are rectangles in his head. Ugh. Fine, you win. Booyah! Yeah, she's unique, but she's uniquely boring. I mean, just look at her. She just sits there by herself all day with that creepy deformed duck toy. <laughs> that's not a deformed duck, that's a platypus. What the heck's a platypus? Quit making words up. Anyway, she's just so off, you know? It's like she's from a totally different planet or something. I know, isn't that cool? Uh, if you're into aliens and that sort of stuff, I guess. But really, if you want to be weird, why don't you just go hang out, hang with the emos and goths? Well, for one, I don't want to ruin my hair. The fact that we got a name for them says a lot, too. Look, Nick, I just, I just don't want to be another typical kid in a sea of typical people. But how the heck would being with her change your own identity? I mean, you'd just be, this, you'd just be some guy who hangs out with a shy girl. She's not just shy, Nick. There's something strange about her. Being strange isn't always a good thing, you know. Do you even know if she wants to be different? Maybe she just wants to fit in like everyone else. And if she does, pushing her the other way wouldn't help, would it? Look, Nick. The point is I know what I need. And she's the one who has it. So, you want her for what she has, but not for her? That's cold, man. I just hope you know what you're doing. I do. I think you're wrong, though. People aren't that typical. Everyone's unique in some way. That's just what grandmas tell you. Wait, so this guy's some kind of human hogger, hogging hipster? That's sort of, uh, disturbing. You know, sometimes I want to slap our clients upside the head. It's high school. Everyone's a bastard. But hey, welcome to the club. Wait. So, this is what he told her about at the cliff? suppose so. So then she went cuckoo and began to make those creepy rabbits, right? Because he confessed this from who knows how long ago? I guess she's pretty good at holding a grudge. I'm not buying it. Something feels missing. Then go get a hat, Sherlock. Come on, I think our passport's leaning against the table there. have the last moment though. I'm envious that this kid was still there to help him move pianos when their hair grew white. I wish I was still in contact with my childhood friends.
Reasons in the detention aside, it's pretty remarkable that they actually met in high school. How many of those go on for more than a month nowadays, huh? I don't know about you, but mine went pretty swimmingly. <laughs> yeah? So swimmingly I say I'm right out the window. Of course it did. Sounds about right. even. No need. I'm all good now. Well, it's not gonna matter, because I can't, uh, I can't do anything until I get the last memory, which I guess is her fucking platypus again. I just love how every time we see this thing, we're guaranteed a free memory link. It must have left as big a scar on his mind as it did on mine. Oh my god, Kame. Oh, for Walnut's sake. Kame. <laughs> hey. Not cool, Eva. You never... You never cock block someone in the middle of a Kamehameha? <laughs> what? She ain't having it. She's not down. Six, huh? Well, usually when I do this, I, I get better results. Stay, Joey. My baby boy growing up so fast. Yeah. What if he was a girl? Would she still nickname him after his grandpa? It wouldn't be that bad, actually, since it ends in E. Joe E. Joe E. Julie. <laughs> sounds cute. If it sounds too cute, why don't you marry him? Ah, jealous. Oh yes, so jealous. Alright, let's save real quick. And I'm actually going to take a quick five minute break. I will be right back.